Hi, this is Gary Buck with Waterline Boats here in Seattle and Helmsman Trawlers. Today we're aboard a 2017 Helmsman Trawler 38E Pilot House. And welcome to this video we call From the Captain's Chair. I would like to focus the things that I have to say today more about captaining one of these vessels than about the details of the boat itself. The boat itself, you can find all kinds of photographs and specifications and details on waterlineboats.com. Go to Boats for Sale or go to Boat Shed Seattle and you'll find all kinds of details of the specifications of the boat. I'd really like to more focus on what it's like captaining one of these boats. My experience is that I've moved these boats many hundreds of miles for clients. This particular one in the photograph was moved from Stewart, Florida to Charleston, South Carolina. By design, this is a low-rise pilot house, which means you only have to step up two steps from the salon area to enter into what is a very large pilot house the pilot house has a large seating area for company to sit at. Um, it has a table, it has access doors out both sides of the pilot house, and it has great visibility all around. From this position, when you're managing the boat, you turn and look aft, you can see both of your stern corners and traffic behind you, which is a bit unusual in a pilot house. Here you see that view from the captain's chair at the lower helm station looking to the stern and you can clearly see both stern corners and traffic. So from the pilot house doors you access the side decks on either side where there are very easy to navigate stairs instead of vertical ladders going up to the flybridge deck. Both doors out of the pilot house have a hawse cleat immediately accessible for the captain to manage the midship lines. This pilot house is easily considered a social area. The settee and table area will seat three people and of course your fourth would be the captain over here. But if this boat were to be ordered new, you could order that seating area as convertible to either a single berth or a double berth. This boat is a semi-displacement trawler. On a spectrum scale, it would be closer to the end for full displacement than it would be the other end for a planing hull. It has a large full-length keel, a protected propeller, and a protected large rudder. The keel and rudder are connected by a metal skeg, which protects those things from below. This particular boat has a bow thruster. The new ones ordered now have bow and stern thruster. When managing this boat underway, one of the noticeable features of the boat that, that is really enjoyable is how well the boat tracks. Once you point this boat the direction you want it to go, it stays on that course and it doesn't wander it. And when you're in a condition where there's beam seas or quartering waves behind you, the boat stays where you point it and it doesn't wander around. In a beam sea, it's very stable, far more stable than a lot of other boats simply because of the design of the shape of the bottom of the boat. It has a very deep forefoot, and because of the size and length of the keel, it keeps you going in a true direction. The large rudder on this boat and the bow thruster gives you the opportunity to park it at a marina and a dock very easily. If you turn your wheel very sharp either direction and just pop it into gear, the wash across that rudder will kick your stern whichever direction you want to go, and with the bow thruster you can move this boat sideways with little more than four to five feet of forward and aft motion. This Helmsman trawler is a design keying on dependability, serviceability, and easy access to systems. The construction of this vessel is all hand laid up. The stringers in the hull are made from composites. It creates an extremely tough boat. There's no flexing in the boat when you're in rough conditions, and that means that long term, you don't have a boat that has a bunch of cracks appearing, and you don't have interior components loosening up over time. These boats are built trawler tough. When you come aboard this boat, you'll notice that the components are all well-known brands. The engine is Cummins, 
The inverter is Magna. The batteries are North Star AGM. The refrigerator is Novacool. The stove in the galley is Force 10. The windlass is Lumar. Everything on board the boat is easily recognizable as a well-known brand name product. There is a second captain's chair on this boat. It's on the flybridge. This particular vessel was ordered with two forward-facing seats and electronic navigation, but this is also a very pleasurable place to manage the boat from. For specifications and hundreds of photographs on this particular vessel, go to Waterline Boats, Boats for Sale, Boats Under 40 Feet. For more information about Helmsman Trawlers, go to Helmsman Trawlers website and take a look at all of the videos that are done on the construction qualities of the boat. If you'd like more information, I'm Gary Buck with Waterline Boats. I can be reached at 253-686-9828 or Gary Buck at Boat Shed Seattle or Gary at WaterlineBoats.com. And thanks for coming to our video from the captain's chair.